with the Go MRI Man. Spread the knowledge. Motivate the people. Um, how to avoid burnout in rad tech school. Like, uh, I think I definitely got some gray hair going through school, man. <laughs> so had a lot of sacrifices uh, going to school and working and I have my family, my wife, my kids. Um, it's hard. It's hard to avoid it. I mean, it's you're going to get burned out, but you got to make time to, you know, go to some go to go to some of those birthday parties, have some fun. Um, do something you love and you know don't cut off all your hobbies definitely try to exercise you got to do some things that are gonna like uh you know release some of that stress you know a good hard uh, exercise um watching some comedy movies something but you can't just be all work 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 because you're just gonna get so burned out but then like you got to see the bigger picture you're like well i'm gonna suffer now it's gonna change my life later Say avoiding burnout is, is going to be using your time the wisest, right? So nice. although there's there's resources like um, Study Blue or Quizlet, that might not be the best place to study because those are students helping students. You want to get it straight from the source, you know. Mm -hmm. So that's what I what I would recommend. Well, we all know school's hard, life's hard, especially nowadays. Uh, everything being online, I don't know. You know, I didn't realize, you know, because my master's degree is all online. And there are plenty of days where I feel so stressed out, but there are mm -hmm. things in life that I love doing, like talking to all the students and other sonographers and rad techs on Instagram and on the discord and just enjoying life at the same time will help you stress less. And there's already like, I try to tell people all the time, there's like so much burnout in the field right now that it's going to be hard if you're burning yourself out trying to get to the burnout kind of thing you're working so hard in school and then to come into this field and then you're going to work even harder because it's your job and you're getting paid you know so it's kind of like really focus on yourself what makes you happy i work out and i like to go out to eat and those things make me happy and then i go study <laughs> so you know just do stuff sure. that you love to do mm -hmm. so in our program it was mandatory that we actually went with the um, with the counselor once hmm. a month. It was mandatory. Whether you wanted to talk to them or not, you had to go. That's pretty cool. You know, yeah. so I think that, that was important. And, and as an instructor right now, we have a very similar program. Like the students at, at any time with the burnout and with the pandemic and everything else happening, they could reach out. There's somebody to reach out to. Even if it's your instructor, like come and talk to us. 